yo what's up guys i just wanted to take a quick second to let you all know that i do run a discord server and i always put the links in the description boxes of every video and everyone is more than welcome to join and with that out of the way let's go ahead and get right onto the video enjoy all right it is time for the lin Kuei cyborg um, Cyrax. I almost called him Triborg, bruh. Oh my god. This ain't MKX, bruh. I literally almost called Hobie Triborg, bruh. That's crazy. Honestly, though, feels good to be back on stream. You feel me? I'm vibing. What are you doing, mister? Yeah, no. You gotta play a little bit smarter than that, sir. Oh, shit. Nope. Oh, bam. That was a good little combo I did right there. Now, Cyrax may not have any damage in this game, but he sure is fast as fuck, though. I'll give him that. Which makes him respectable, kind of. Damn. Oh, shit. Alright, come here. Ooh. Ooh, okay. I was getting nervous because one combo from him, I would have lost the round. round yeah, Cyrax isn't really all that good in this game. He's definitely low tier, unfortunately. He has good recovery though, but other than that, it's like, meh, he ain't all that. Damn. Now, what sucks is that he doesn't have a voice in this game, but it makes sense because he's a cyborg, but damn, no voice though? That's kind of crazy. Now, I don't know if he has a voice in his um, human costume though. I think he does, or I think he doesn't, I mean, but who knows? Damn. He tear my ass up. Yeah. Yep, I knew chip damage was going to get you. Okay, now that that mirror match is over with, we should be good. Because, man, a Cyrax mirror match is actually difficult. Because Cyrax is, like I said, really fast. He has really good recovery uh, off of most of his strings. So it's kind of hard to punish him when it's a mirror match. Alright, let's go. Now it's time for Try Hard Raiden. Alright, let's go. Now things should get more interesting since I'm not doing a fucking mirror match. Things should be a lot better now. Maybe. If Raiden doesn't go sweat mode on me, that is. And we all know Raiden loves to do that. Oh, I thought that would have been a guaranteed grab, bro. Whoa. Shit. Yeah, I don't think so, Raiden. Come on now. I'm kind of used to your games. I fought you way too many times. And honestly, I'm shocked that um, Deadly Alliance has, you know, been completed this fast. Like, we're almost done. We just had the bonus characters, of course, but, you know. Other than that, we're pretty much done. And then we're going to move on to Deception Conquest, which is going to be amazing. Yeah, I don't think so. Shit. All right, time for some Sambo. You about to get mixed up, boy. Shit, I fucked it up. There we go. GG. Get stabbed. Hold that L. Nice pose, Cyrax. Nice pose. That was a clean sweep. I ain't gonna lie. Raiden actually got bodied. Shockingly. Round one. Like, mocap was just built different, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Shit. Now, Vitara is also built different, you know, losing to her twice, because she just completely outclasses me. Man. Finally, I get a punish in. 
so hard to punish her, bro. While I'm Cyrax. Damn. There we go. <laughs> Somehow that combo worked. I will take that shit. That was weird. Round two. Fight. Yeah, I don't know how that worked. PS2 logic? Hell yeah, bro. That's literally how it goes. Like, there's so many goofy ass fatalities in Deadly Alliance, it's not even funny, bro. Like, Sub-Zero's, in my opinion, is probably one of the goofiest in this game. Just logic-wise. Oh no, she's doing the mix-ups. Oh, don't put me in the acid! I'm a robot, bro! I'm gonna die! I'm just spamming her with mix-ups right now. No! The acid went for me instead of her, bro. Damn. Round three. Fight. All right. Come on. We got this, Cyrax. We got to use Sambo on her ass. Come on. Did not want to taunt, but okay. That is very dangerous against Itara, especially when she has her power-up damage. Like, bro, that is one of the riskiest plays. Huh? Somehow. Shit, I kept fucking that up. Damn. <laughs> that setup is crazy. Okay, I'll take that. Let's go. I don't know how we won, but hey, I'm not even mad, bro, because like I said, Cyrax versus the Tara in this game is ridiculous. The, uh, Cyrax will never win that matchup. Nah, I don't know. I know Sub Zero should be easy. He's mid tier. The Tara was top tier, so. And then Sub-Zero actually has punishable strings, like a normal person. Like, look at that. I'm just bodying this man. Damn! <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, I destroyed Sub-Zero. That's what I'm saying, bro. It just depends on the character, man. Like, if I get a really, like broken character that just outclasses Cyrax in every way, then yeah, I'm not gonna win. Like, if I have to fight Scorpion in this ladder, bro, I'm literally fucked. I guarantee it. I will never win. Cyrax is terrible damage, and then Scorpion's crazy mix-up game? Like, nah, bro. That is so busted, bro. <laughs> oh, shit, I fucked that up. My bad. I did the input wrong. It's all good. I'll try to pull off the fatality on Kung Lao, another mid-tier character that I'm pretty sure I can beat. That they would pick on people like that. Like, real shit, that's pretty sad. There's probably some little ass kids that don't know any better. You know what I'm saying? And then they fall for that dumb shit. They get their shit clapped. I don't even know why Twitch, uh, Twitch allows that shit, low key. But I mean, there's nothing they can really do, per se. Like, look at that. I'm punishing him clear as day, and then I still get fucked over. Most of the time. Just because of his range in ninjutsu, his ass. Yeah, I don't think so. There we go, finally pull it off straight. Ha, <laughs> you fell for it, GG. That move is kind of fast. You can honestly fall for it pretty easily. Yeah, and just out of curiosity too, they could get fucked over doing that too. That's why I was like, fuck that shit, man. I don't trust people that do that shit.
It's like I'm not trusting Kung Lao with this dumbass sword. Because this dude is known to trick my ass for no reason. There we go. Yeah, come here. And that move right there is really good because it keeps um keeps the opponent away if they do power up. I really love that move. That's a really good tactical move from Cyrax. Alright, let's go. Wow, you're really starting to piss me off, bro. You're really starting to be an issue. It just sucks when these uh, characters have good frames, just like Cyrax does, because then you're basically playing frames. Like, if Kung Lao stayed in Shaolin Fist, he would get bodied. Guaranteed. And the AI knows that shit. That's why he's staying in Sword, because he knows, like, Kung Lao is ass. Wow, that actually worked? Okay. This kind of changes the game a little bit, but I don't think I'll be able to pull anything off. Alright. This should be it. Goodbye. Ha! <laughs> Last ditch effort, eh? Ah, oh, homie. It's over. You're definitely getting this fatality for being a pussy, though. Like, bro. I don't know why he was trying to play with my frames like that. That's crazy. Not even Try Hard Rated was doing that shit. So now you get in the meat grinder. Fatality. Hold that L, bro. Yeah, they're going to try hard this ladder. Now, somebody like Kenshi? Oh, yeah, I'm going to body him. That's no problem. Round one. He's very punishable, so I'll be all right. Especially if he's going to do his telekinetic moves. Definitely going to punish him, no problem. And I'm glad that I didn't get Scorpion or fucking Reptile in this ladder. Because, bro, if either one of them would have showed up in this ladder, I would have been screwed. There we go. Beautiful combo. Come here. Oh, I wasn't expecting him to do that. You good? Kobe? Oh, that backflip was crazy. Shit. What the f Okay, I don't know how I did that, but um, I'll take that. I don't know how the fuck I was able to counter that mid-string. That's crazy. Like, what the fuck? I'm at a loss of words for that one. I be pulling off some weird-ass bullshit sometimes. Come on now. Whoa. Damn. Oh, I fucked it up. GG! Alright, let me do this. Uh, and then kicks the camera. Alright, I see you, Cyrax. You on that Jax bullshit. Oh, we got Movado last? Okay, that could be a problem. I mean, Movado isn't really that much of an issue. It's just like in his uh, log fist, he's an issue. But if he's in Wing Chun or his hook swords, I could punish him. And Katana over here is never an issue. She is so punishable. Like, it's crazy. I don't know how I was able to dominate with her, bro. Like, I, I don't know. It's just she's built different, I guess. There we go. Damn, Katana, I see you with the resets. I could have... Oh, well, never mind. I was going to say I could have stabbed you, but, you know. There's that. Whoa. I don't think so, ma'am. Oh, shit. I'm going to die. Oh, never mind. Let's go. We got lucky as fuck. Hey, it's my moderator ninja. Let's go. Damn, she going crazy on these combos. 
Okay, girl. You could, you could do all that. That's cool. Don't even worry about it. Look at me mixing her up. Let's go. Hold that. All right. Sorry, Katana, but you know, I have to kill you, bro. All right. That was easy. Of course, it's Katana. Like, Katana matchup, it's almost guaranteed you're going to win every time. Unless you're dropping. Round one. Now, Movado is going to be a problem if he stays in Log Fist. But if he doesn't stay in Log Fist, we're good. But I guess we'll find out as we keep playing. Damn. Oh, shit. Okay. You can do that. It's all right. I ain't gonna hold it against you. You know what I'm saying? Okay. You go uh, hold back on that one. Oh, I was trying to punish a mid string. That could have been bad. In that exact combo that he just did, if he would have done that earlier, he would have got the round way earlier. Because for some reason, that combo is broken in this game. It does like insane amount of damage. I think that string does like 35 to 40% by itself bro like that shit is crazy so you really gotta watch out for that string when movado does it but it's rare damn i keep on fucking up that uh string bro i don't know why i don't know if i'm not going fast enough or i'm doing the inputs weird there we go Oh, you just got home? Good shit, bro. I appreciate you for coming by, Ninja. Thank you. And if you want to know, like, what happened yesterday, the other server got shut down, bro. So we're sticking to the one that you've been in for a while. So that's a good thing, then. Because now all the homies are back where they're supposed to be. So we're good. Oh, he actually avoided that shit. Oh. Okay, Mr. Movado. All right, I'm gonna quit fucking around. Hobie is like going sweat. I don't like that shit. Oh, you shouldn't have done that. Okay. Okay. Let's go. We got lucky as fuck, bro. That could have went so bad. All right, now it's on to Moloch, I believe. And all we have to do is stay in ninjutsu and we're good. I guarantee it. So Moloch, you're about to die a slow death. All right, let's go, let's go. You ain't ready for this, Moloch. See what you got. I knew he's gonna go for a grab, you motherfucker. I don't know if that'll be the string. Oh, it can be though. You gotta be very fast with it though. Oh shit. I knew it. I knew he's gonna go for a grab, you bastard. Let me see if that one works. That could work, but. No! That was my chance to get the, you know, the combos on him. Damn. Come on, Moloch. You know you want to. There we go. Right there. What? We really messed up our chance. Yeah, Hobie's actually in it. Oh, shit. Oh. I can't believe I might actually lose to Homeboy with Cyrax, bro. That's crazy. Yeah, four win streak so far. I'm doing all right. I struggled pretty hard against Nitara, though. That kind of pissed me off. I ain't gonna lie. Because Nitara just kept spamming her mix-ups with her uh, Kabas or Kabas, whatever you want to call them. That shit was pissing me off. Damn it, I hate it when he stops falling for it. Okay. Come on, Moloch. 
You know you want to do something crazy. Yeah, he really does not like falling for that shit. This might actually be a problem. Fuck! Fuck. Come on, swing! Bitch! Haha! <laughs> this is crazy! Why is he not falling for it with Cyrax? Dude, Cyrax is bad luck. I see why Sasuke Uzumaki was going crazy that one year when he had to play as Cyrax. This shit is just unacceptable. Oh, now you want to start falling for it. Come on now. Yo. Come on now. Okay. Hold that. There we go, GG. Man, if I would have lost to Bolog, bro, I would have got pissed. That was difficult, dude. Wow. Okay. GG's. All right, let's see if we can fight the Deadly Alliance now. I wish Quan Chi was first, though. I definitely would have had a better time. All right, the first one of the Deadly Alliance, it is you, Shang Tsung. Now, fortunately for me, Shang Tsung is punishable. We all know this. So, you know, it should be easy Ws. As long as he doesn't do anything like that or spam reversals, we should be okay. But it seems like so far he's really trying to do that. He's trying to be a sweat. Look at him. He really doesn't like that shit. There we go. There's the strings I'm looking for. Yep, do those stupid strings for me. There we go. I want to keep him around, but... Oh, that was lucky. I ain't gonna lie. That was pure luck. Especially that second kick. Because he easily could have blocked that and then punished me. For some reason, he did it. I'll take that shit. Fuck. Oh, yo, that works. Okay. There we go. Come on. Damn, he's got good recovery off of that pop-up streak. Or not string, but just pop up hit. Come on. All right, let me kind of stop fucking around. Okay, I'm done. Seems like he doesn't want to play with me today. How are you falling for this? You're supposed to be max difficulty. What the fuck? You literally fell for like three strings in a row. How is that even possible? Okay, I, I'll take it. My RNG is good with Cyrax. If only, you know, my boy Chris had this luck. You feel me? That one year, bro. I feel bad. Oh, yeah. He doesn't transform into his opponent in this game. That's mainly in, like, the um, newer games, like MK9 and um, 11. He doesn't really do them in the 3D era. Which, I mean... It's fine. I mean, that would have been lit if Shang Tsung would have had something like that in the 3D era. That would have been a game changer. But low-key, that would have made him really broken and competitive. No doubt. In the 3D era, if he would have had that. Yeah! Damn! He fucked me up! Oh, shit! There we go. And yeah, it's definitely not the same as MK9 Cyrax. <laughs> Dude, MK9 Cyrax is disgusting on so many levels, bro. Like, that dude is cursed. My dude, my dude fucking Cyrax has been through a Jiren arc from Deadly Alliance to MK9. He's been on a Jiren arc. That dude is... Why, why are you doing that? 
Why are you doing that right now? He's being such a pussy right now, bro. This is why nobody likes this dude. Straight up. He really swept me like six times in a row just because he wanted damage. That's just crazy. That couldn't be me, though. There we go. Reset you up. Oh! Okay, just waiting on you pretty much. Wow, baited. You're done. You're done, bitch. Fuck you, bro. Uh, coward ass character, bro. Get this fatality, bro. Yeah, he had like 80% combos. That dude was crazy. I think if you even like did it correctly, like the resets correctly, you could literally touch of death somebody with mk9 cyrax but you had to be like perfect though and that's just how broken he was in mk9 i would maybe play mk9 for the stream one day but i don't know it's not really my type of game i fuck with it though but all right let's hear cyrax's ending the enormous heat and pressure of the lava burned out cyrax's sensors almost immediately he cast about blindly in the infernal pit, searching for the orb Nitara had sent him to locate. Cyrax found it resting upon a small submerged pedestal beneath the molten depths. As soon as he clambered to the surface, she demanded he hand over the orb. Nitara had promised to return Cyrax to Earthrealm once the orb had been retrieved. Taking her necklace in hand, she uttered a mystical incantation. A swirling portal opened around Cyrax had he only had time for a solemn bow before he was swept into the gateway.